y'all. What it do? What it do? It's your girl T. You know, back with another message. Hey, friend. What's up? I hope y'all having a good day. Okay, so yeah, I really, I got a real uh, message I want to tell you guys. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna have, if I'm gonna have no time, but I'm not gonna think of focus on the time real quick. But this is a collective reading, right? And remember to only take resonate and leave with do not friend. But now is the the time. For change, right? Where you're going to be seeing a lot of people going to have going to be very versatile. As in like there's gonna be a lot of people out here that's going to be doing different things in their life. They're gonna be living their life purpose, but they're gonna be you might see a police, they might be a police officer, and they also might be a judge if you could do two things. It's gonna be like it's gonna be you're gonna see a lot of things that don't match with people, but you're gonna be like, damn, you do that too. You know, so you might see a, a police officer that do um, therapy on the side, or a police officer that might be a motivational speaker, or a, a police. I'm just saying, for example, y'all, this is going to be a lot of Mitch Mackey. You get what I'm saying? Because people are learning that you don't, just because you do one thing, I mean, you got to just do that one thing because you're good at it. You know what I'm saying? Like, we, we're we going to shed old skin. You get what I'm saying? What you did in one season, you might ain't going to do that in another season. You get what I'm saying? You might be a police officer. Three years, I mean, um, five of your your years of your life, and then you might be a judge the next five many of I mean, next five years of your life. Then after that, you might want to be a teacher the next five years. It's gonna be a whole lot of flip flopping, and I feel like it's because the chosen are the chosen people are being freed. They are being free. They are being spiritually freed from whatever was holding them back. The darkness. Okay. So I was wanting to tell y'all that. And I also got a new love read that's supposed to do. But I just want to tell y'all that real quick, y'all. I thought I was gonna have no time to do both. But I got something to do today. So I'm trying to uh make this useful, useful, okay? And uh useful as as well. I might pull on a new love reading this week. Make I might make it both. Okay, but you don't be shocked when y'all start seeing a lot of people being more versatile. Like it's like the a lot of people being freed. Okay, a lot of people that been like this for a long time. A lot of people who got bullied. A lot of people who the enemy try to steal their joy at an early age are now being freed. Okay, so a lot of y'all might get out of this. Okay, I feel like if you in this right now, you won't be in there for long. Okay, what is the message, spirit? So Father God, this is your light. Me the best. We said that's protect my angel, my space, and my aura. And it's the channel of our angels of light. And it's not light. It's not welcome. I'm here we only call on the divine people of the divine things of the divine the beings of the divine anything that's not of the divine is not welcome here y'all is not welcome here and make sure and check your sound y'all because sometimes i make videos you now the sound we gone okay so we're a good standing let's see i can make sure my phone i hate to have my phone on loud but i have to do that when i'm making videos so especially when i know i got stuff got, i got playing i'm busy and she you know but i know it's opposite but when i got somebody on the way or when you don't wait on a certain call or text. Okay, so let's get to it. So what's going on, boo? What's going on? I got, I'm going to give y'all some more longer. Ooh, they got a new love. One love, one love. Yeah, yeah, one love, one love. Okay, then. What's going on? Look, it says time to focus on your play now. So, I look, it said take care of yourself first. And I feel like a lot of y'all about to do that. And a lot of y'all about to get very creative. What I did see, y'all, you're going to be seeing a lot of people being very versatile. They're going to be doing a lot of different things. And it might be you, friend. You go, you go, If you part of the chosen crew, you know exactly who I'm talking about. I feel like I speak for a lot of the chosen. I speak for the people that's of the divine. You get what I'm saying? I feel like I speak to those type of people. And I also speak to those who God wants me to speak to. Whoever the message for. I feel like a lot of y'all are taking off the mask. You are no longer being the original. You're no longer being or ordinary. Like ordinary people. Like the, you're not being regular no more. Some of y'all are meant to be the um some of y'all could be the black sheep. You are meant to be um you are meant to be that magical being that break the curses or break the cycles. You're not gonna be the same person you used to be. You are about to be more of your magical being. You're about to be more of yourself, your authentic truth. Even if people don't understand it, you're gonna be a little more weirdo. Okay, period. You are able you able to come out the shell now. So y'all break it free. You know what I'm saying? Free my folks, free my sis, free my brother now. You know what I'm saying? Free y'all. Look, because I feel like a lot of people could have made you. They did so much projecting on you at an early age. And the enemy made you feel so uncomfortable with being yourself. To the point it made you hate yourself. Look, it said you are being self-hate. You're being too hard on yourself. And it said, are you putting your all in it? And I feel like a lot of y'all are. I feel like a lot of y'all do have a lot of overflow in your life. Or you're going to be loving yourself a little different. You're going to be loving yourself a little different, friend. And this is what going, this is why this coming in. Okay. I feel like a lot of y'all, y'all about to be loved, being loved on correctly. Okay. 
I feel like y'all, um, cause you are loving yourself different. Like when you start handling yourself different, people gonna you gonna start attracting people who gonna handle you different as well. Okay, other people who be a little more selfish. And some of y'all are mean to see y'all might teaching people how to be a little more selfish because a lot of y'all are learning how to be a little more selfish. And you might be teaching people how to be more selfish in a more healthier way, okay? You don't have to be a mean girl to be uh you don't have to get back to you know you don't have to be a mean girl to be a, a, a beautiful person. You get what I'm saying? You don't have to be closed off, you don't have to pretend to be a mean girl to protect your peace either, okay? So like I said, you are overlooking. It's are you overlooking something? Okay, I feel like a lot of y'all could have been very loyal to I heard, I heard to other people or to your failures to the mask. You very loyal to the person that you was never meant to be. You was just the, the person that you you know that you built and you 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 created and became in survival mode. Okay, I feel like a lot of y'all getting out of survival mode. Okay, look, it said, are you putting your all in it? And it said, how people treat you is their karma. How you react is yours. And I feel like a lot of y'all, y'all reacting different. You moving different. Okay? Hold up, y'all. Okay, what else, y'all? Let's see. Look, it said, God time is not time. It's like, like this is when you least expect. Some of y'all went through a rebirth, a different rebirth when you least expected. You did not know you was going to be this person that you are. But God said, look, you are so faithful. I'm going to need you to be faithful to yourself. I'm going to need you to love yourself. I'm going to need you to show up for yourself how you show up for other people. And I feel like this is why you are so abundant. This is why things are over becoming an overflow in your life. I feel like a lot of y'all about to have a whole lot of overflow. Let's say, shh, you're talking too much. Move in silence. So make sure you are being faithful to you, being faithful to your truth. Also, just keeping some things to yourself because everybody ain't going to be happy for you, friend. We know that. Okay, look, I said, are you reflecting or are you just pointing fingers? I feel like a lot of y'all, y'all reflecting and you are no longer pointing fingers because you know that you play a major part in, you know, allowing people to, you know, belittle you or just sit in it in this situation. I feel like a lot of y'all are done sitting in toxic situations that don't make you happy anymore. Look, I said, are you reflecting or are you pointing fingers? Okay, clarify the spirit. Look, it says self hate. You are you're being too hard on yourself. I feel like a lot of y'all could have been um you could have had a lot of people projecting on you to the point you started projecting on other people. That's not gonna be for everybody though. And spirit showing you now that you are the magical being that you always meant to be. You just you know you just you know you just allow a lot of people to project on you and you believe the lies and you know it's not your fault. You just like hey you're not responsible for what happened to you, but you are responsible for how you heal. And I feel like a lot of y'all are healing now. Like I said, find something fun to do and say, are you putting your all in it? So I feel like a lot of y'all are, um, if you are not happy at this moment, if you are feeling confused, are you feeling irritated? Spirit saying, are you putting your all in it? Are you pouring love in it? It's something that you want to do. Are you really passionate about it? If you're not passionate about it, then what are you doing? Start doing things that make you flow. To pour, they pour back into you. I feel like a lot of y'all, you might be doing something wrong. You might ain't putting enough love in. You might be focusing on the negative things. I feel like a lot of y'all, it said, win if you can, lose if you must, but never quit. Period. Okay? So, look, y'all. But, um, I feel like if something not working out with you, maybe you are focusing on the money a little too much or the or the, or the materialistic things or just worry about numbers too much or timing too much. Spirit said, focus on the love. You pour love in, watch how it flow for you. Okay? Like... Like overflow, okay. So what's going on? So y'all know a lot of y'all got a new love coming in, okay? Yeah, I got new love coming in. I want to touch bases on that. Let's see what's going on with you in this new lover, boo. Look, I know it's you. So somebody's crushing on you, collector. Somebody's crushing on you, and it's somebody who could be very faithful. I feel like I feel like this also could be somebody who can relate to you a lot. I feel like this is somebody who also went through a death and rebirth. I feel like somebody who. Um, learning to accept the things with life, you know, learning to accept the life is not fair. Learning that there is beauty inside of life is not just hurt and pain. I feel like somebody is rewriting a love story and you are in it. Look, it said, God sent me to you. Ooh, that's so cute. It's so cute. I love it. I love it, y'all. God sent me to you because you was, y'all was ready for each other. I'm here. Make me sad. Make me harder, make me lose my cool, make me harder. Oh, something's gonna be flowing like water. Somebody's gonna be actually going overflow. All right, somebody might be drinking that, eat, uh, drinking that water and eating them, eating them, uh, pineapple juices. I mean, eating them pineapples and drinking some pineapple juices and stuff like that. Because, girl, if somebody's gonna be overflow, somebody's gonna make somebody lose their cool, <laughs> make me harder. Like, somebody might open you up like you've never been opened up before. And I feel like it's gonna be the same for them as well, girl. Okay, look, I choose you. Period. And what else? It's, it's something about you to draw me to you. 
This is somebody who might have a lot of options, y'all. But this is somebody who chose you, friend. Like I said, I chose you. It's, going to, it's something about you that draw me to you. And it says, scared to take the wrong risk. So they might be they might be a little hesitant. Okay? Y'all, this reading ain't going to be too uh, too long. I'm going to have to get y'all a part two when I get back, when I get a chance. Okay? Yeah. Like I said, I like your heart. This is what's going to pull them to you, y'all. It's something about your heart. God, like, why is you steady to choose? Steady to put, they, might, like, they might be a little irritated with spirit. Like, why do you keep putting this person on my mind? And you might, they might be, if you know this person, y'all, it depends on who your person is. If y'all know them, you might like, why they put, I'm putting, why God putting this person on my mind? It's something with this person. It's something that y'all relate to. It might be the hard. Like, this is somebody, don't judge the books by its cover because this is, might be somebody who got everything that you want, that you desire and more, okay? And it's just like, spirit, like, I'm going to see, if, are, you, are you going to be obedient? Are you going to listen to me? Okay, let's get it. Let's get it, book. Let's see. Okay, look at that. I'm shy. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> I be finding cute with me. We blushing. They be a little shy at you. Uh, like, be, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it be kind of cute when you make them a little nervous. You make somebody shy. This might be somebody when they come around you, they're going to be a little nervous. You're going to see it. They're going to be blushing a lot. They're going to try not to hide it, but you're going to see it. Okay, like some of y'all, this is somebody who cannot wear a mask of, uh, around you. You're going to make somebody take off the mask. Okay, oh, they're gonna make you take off the mask, baby. Take the rose, it resonate, book. Look, it said, I'm questioning myself a lot about you because they're wondering who are you. Okay, look, it said, I know it's you. Look, <laughs> they second guess, they keep on second guessing themselves and they keep on coming right back to you. I like you, it's something about you, collector. This is cute. I like this light hard energy. I feel like this is somebody who you're gonna have a lot of fun with. Okay. Yeah, it's just like, I don't know. It's just like, they, they want to have a lot of fun with you. And they see a future with you, but they scared. Look, CB, dream. I can make you dream. That ain't there, but it's Cree Brown, dream, y'all. That's my song. Now look what you done started. That song's so freaky, baby. Cree Brown freak is a ball. Fuck, I, I know that. Baby, had them songs be sad. Like, he be knowing what he doing in that bedroom. And I feel like there's somebody who might know what they doing in the bedroom. For I know they don't really matter to a lot of y'all. But the younger generation, y'all know how we get down. Y'all know like y'all like to have something kind of fun and, and some kind of, you know, spicy. And a little spontaneous, spontaneous, or um, adventurous, uh, something like that. It's somebody like, I'm like, I'm getting, why I keep on hearing hasty? Yeah, baby, princess treat me. Baby, because they know it's you, baby. Somebody, you're going to have somebody open up like they never have before. It said, you scared me low-key, high-key. Yeah, it's something about your energy because they know it's you. They know you the one for them. You the one that I think about always. Oh, eh, eh. Your love is my love. My love is your love. Hey, baby, I need you here. here mm -mm. Uh -uh. The time. Uh -uh 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 -uh. I look scared to get close. This is someone who's been hurt before. Oh, this is so cute. I feel like this is going to be brutal. I feel like I'm a little challenging because it's going to be kind of slower than what you used to. But I feel like it's going to be uh, very, very, very worth the wait. Okay, so curious if you are single for real or are you lying. Somebody's scared that you're going to play them. Okay, what else? Look, it said, I want to get to know you. Somebody want a deeper connection with you. But they're a little scared because they like you. They're curious about you. This is somebody who probably been crushing on you. But they've been led to you by the divine. So this is somebody, if you don't even know them, they know you. Okay? Or they know of you. Or this is somebody, when they see you at first sight, they're going to know it's you. You're going to scare them. You're going gonna, gonna to have them acting abnormal than they used to. They said, we are meant to be, can you see? And I feel like um, one of y'all going to know. It's like some of y'all some of y'all going to be in siren energy. One going to be a little more braver than the other one. Look, it's like I've been in your life the whole time. So this might be somebody that know you, okay? This somebody know you, but you might don't know them, okay? They, they know that y'all meant to be. They've been called. I feel like this is a masculine. This is getting led to a feminine, okay? Because the spirit said, hey, you are the head and not the tail, so I'm going to need you to lead, okay? So go. Do stuff that you're scared, a little scared to do. Look, it said, we, we haven't met yet, but I'm coming. They haven't told you who they are yet. And look, it said, oh, you are mine now. Somebody reclaim you, boo. Somebody I reclaim you said heart to heart conversations. Y'all going to be opening up a lot. Okay, one more card screen. We done. Look, it said uh no, there's a sign on this. 
Yeah, same called CB Dream. Look, I said, have we met before? Like, your energy is very familiar. You feel like home to somebody. And it said, your spirit is uh, is uplifting. It's so uplifting. So, this is why you bringing somebody in. And spirit might be coming when... This person going to come in when you are in your prime, y'all. Okay? When you're not going to be in a codependent energy. I feel like y'all not codependent anyway. But spirit ain't going to let you be needy. Too needy. Okay? Because this might be somebody... You might, you might bring out some insecurities in somebody. You are meant to scare this masculine, y'all. You are meant to make them question themselves, okay? Because you're going to break away them. You're going to make them break away from this mask, okay? So, baby, I hope y'all take a resonate and leave with you. Not this is going to be part one. I hope I have time to come back and give y'all another one. But bear with you, girl, okay? I love you. Bye. People are going to label you. It's how you overcome those labels. That's what matters.